Well, Romelu Lukaku is in the news once again, talking about Chelsea and Inter Milan, saying that he takes Inter Milan seriously, which is a massive slap in the face for any Chelsea fans, including myself. I had thoughts that maybe this guy could come back to Chelsea after having another loan spell at Inter Milan and possibly redeeming himself at this club. But after what he said, there's no way of coming back from this. You pretty much spit on the club itself that bought you from Inter Milan, brought you back in the Premier League, and tried to make you this elite striker in front of the entire world. And yet, for some reason, you were not grateful at all for this. It, it's quite remarkable. Now, I do understand there were some issues with the club itself, with Thomas Tuchel, maybe even with the last owners, with Abramovich. But still, this is a whole new club now. Todd Bull is the new owner, along with a few other people along with the board. We also have a new manager coming in, Pochettino. So again, this is a whole new wave at this club. And yet, for some odd reason, Romelu Lukaku takes the advantage to, again, just talk crap about Chelsea, which is still currently their his current team, which, again, is quite mind-boggling to do that. Because right now, if you're trying to possibly get sold, yes, this may be a possible way to do it, but he's tanking his value right now and therefore again this could have future implications for this player now whether he does get sold or he just rides the bench at Chelsea which is a possibility I hope that's not the case because we are paying him way way too much money and therefore again we do have to offload this player and again I'm just quite shocked at what he was saying and I did make a video about two weeks ago about possibly his redemption but after what's come up and what he said there's no way he can redeem himself even if he goes out and bangs a bunch of goals for Chelsea the fans are never going to rally behind him. The fact that you said you never took this club seriously and knew that Inter Milan could always be a fallback, not exactly what he said, but again, reading between the lines for the most part, is quite astonishing. That again, you would go to a Premier League club that had won the Champions League just a couple seasons prior to that and think that, you know what, it might not work out, so I'm just going to you know fall back on Inter Milan is, again, shocking to say the least. And the fact that, again... He's still contracted with Chelsea. I could understand if he was sold from Chelsea to come out and say this, but again, I do not understand what goes through this guy's mind when he thinks, oh, this is going to be a good PR session. I should maybe mention this because it is not. And again, because of this, there's no way that we're going to have this player at Chelsea again playing for us. So again, I'm very, very baffled by this player and who knows what his future is. And lo and behold, watch, he'll probably win the Champions League with Inter Milan and therefore rub it in our faces again. And at this point, I'm not too sure how I feel about Inter Milan winning because if they do, that means he wins. But I also don't want to see Manchester City win. But at the same time, I think Pep Guardiola deserves to win it at Manchester City with everything they've done. So again, hopefully Pep Guardiola can stop him from winning. That would be kind of icing on the cake for Romelu Lukaku. But that being said, Pochettino needs to find a new striker. We cannot rely on Romelu Lukaku because obviously this player does not have a future at the club. So I want to know what you guys think about this interview with Romelu Lukaku and what he said about Chelsea. If you guys think it was a smart move on his part or your thoughts, your takes, comment down below. I'll get to those comments as soon as I possibly can. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe down below. I greatly appreciate that. And I will see you in our next video.